Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala loves us so much. Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala cares about us so much. I would like to share with you a hadith that captures a conversation that took place between Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala and Prophet Dawood alayhi salam. Listen to what Allah says to Dawood. Allah tells him, Ya Dawood, لو يعلم المدبرون عني كيف انتظاري لهم ورفقي بهم وشوقي إلى ترك معاصيهم الله أكبر الله سبحانه وتعالى تلز داود داود if those people who have turned away from me who forgotten that they have a Lord if they know how much I long for them to come back to me Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala is saying this to Dawood. Lamatu shawqan ilayya wa taqatta'at awsaluhum min mahabbati. If they knew how much I long for them to come back to me, to have a good relationship with me, they would die out of their longing and their happiness. If they only knew. Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala loves his servants. This is the first point over here. That we remember that Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala cares about us. The second point, some people ask the question, but how can I really feel practically that God loves me? I know theoretically He created me, I'm His servant. Okay, He cares about me, He loves me. But I want to feel that practically in my life. How do I feel the love of Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala in my life? I'll share with you four quick tips on how to feel and experience the love of God in your life. Number one, whenever you're wondering, does God love you? How do I know He really loves me? Ask yourself this question, how much do you love Allah? How much time do you spend with your Lord? At night when everyone is asleep, you have some private time, do you talk to Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala? You want to feel the love of God? Talk to Him every day. Pour your heart out to Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala. Make Allah your best friend. I guarantee you, you will feel that warmth in your heart. That's the first tip. The second tip lies in the obedience of God. You want to feel the love of Allah? Obey the commands of God. Allah will reveal the warmth of His love in your heart. And believe me, when you know that you've obeyed Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala, at night you sleep with peace of mind. Even if you're going through anxiety, depression, other problems. But when you know that you serve the path of Allah, you're doing that which satisfies Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala. That in itself brings ease to your heart. The third tip is to educate yourself with knowledge. Understand the depths of the Qur'an. Seek religious sciences and also academic sciences. The more you increase in knowledge, the more you will feel the love of Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala. This is a guarantee. And that's why we have Imam Ali ibn Abi Talib alayhi salam in a beautiful hadith. He talks about loneliness. The Imam says the best company to help you with loneliness is knowledge. There will come a time if you train yourself to love knowledge, where nothing will satisfy your heart, your mind, your soul, and your life more than knowledge. The more you seek knowledge, the more you feel you're fulfilled. The more you feel the love of Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala. And number four, the fourth tip here, my dear brothers and sisters, is to help those in need. You want to feel the love of Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala? Go and help someone who's in need. Give charity in the way of Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala. Spend from your time, volunteer. Volunteering is, has been proven through scientific studies that it helps with depression and anxiety. It helps with loneliness. People who regularly volunteer at a community center, at a mosque, at a charitable organization, their mental state is much better. Their mental health is much better. Go and give from your time. Try it, my dear brothers and sisters. Help out someone who's poor, someone who's in need. Someone who's psychologically struggling and you go and you give them some relief, that night you will feel better. You will feel the love of Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala. When Allah sees you 
on his path of obedience, he will bring down that love in your heart and you will really experience the love of Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala.